In today's video, I'll be showing you how to create a locked folder using a batch script in Windows. Now, this is the easiest way to do it without installing any additional software, especially if you are using a shared computer or if you don't have admin rights. So the first thing you want to do is uh, create a folder. I'm going to create my folder on my desktop. So right click new and folder and you could name your folder uh, whatever you like i'm just going to name it private okay now uh, we need to open um, notepad editor so go to start look for notepad and just open it now let's uh, paste this uh, script it can be found down in the description and uh, just go to file save as and uh, you want to look for the folder we just created so it's on my desktop and it's this one private now under save as type just select um, all files and for the name just name it whatever you like i'm just going to name it cron dot bat and make sure to, to give it the extension dot uh, bat and save okay so now once um once it's saved just close it and let's go back to the folder so let's execute this um script double click on it the first time you will execute this it will ask you to enter a password so i'm going to say pass one two three and enter and enter again okay so basically it has created um, a folder but it has locked it so we need to um, double click on it again and it's going to ask us for the password again so just enter the same password you and now it's going to unlock the folder so now we have a folder that is named uh, locked inside that folder we could uh, place all the files we would like to lock so in this example, I'm just going to um, place some files over here. So I'm going to drag and drop these two uh, files. I have a text file and I have an image file. And let's go back and let's execute uh, the script again. So double click on it. And then you will see this uh, command prompt window. Just enter the password you like and enter and enter again so now the file is um is locked and hidden no one can see it so whoever comes over here and open this they won't be able to see the locked folder so if they double click on it and just enter a random password it won't um, open it it would just ask them to enter the correct password so let's enter the correct password okay and now i could see the folder and i could see all my files okay so now let's take a look on how this uh, script works so let's go back and just right click on this and go to show more options and maybe edit okay so now um, looking at this the first time this uh, script executes it will check if there is a folder name uh, locked if it's not it will create that folder and then it will check if there is um, a text file name password.txt if there is no file it will jump to this label which is over here and then it will ask you um, to enter a password once you enter the password it will basically enter that password inside that file so it will create a file name password.txt and it will store that password you entered inside that file and then it will change the attribute of the folder locked to hidden so no one can see it and then it will uh, basically end the script now if you execute this a second time since the folder exists and the file exists it will come over here and it will ask you to enter a password once you enter the password it will match it to the password you entered uh, previously if it matches it will basically changes the attribute of the folder locked 
back to unhidden and you will be able to see it and it will delete the password the file so next time you try to lock it it will ask you for a new uh, password and that's uh, basically how it works now i'm sure there are other um, secure ways of locking your files but that was an easy and quick way of um, having fun with the command prompt i hope you enjoyed what you watched today please consider subscribing and i will see you on the next video thank you Thank you.